Hey, we do have Champions League today. We've got like Champions League group stage, whole bunch of intense matches. We just lost away to Chelsea, but we did beat Chelsea at home. So our Champions League group is the spice right now. Seven, seven, four, four. My local After four matches. Oh yeah, and the league is just wilding right now. Rapid Vienna's top of the league. We got a match at hand on them in Salzburg. Reindorf Altosh is also just absolutely balling right now. There's a lot of crazy things going on. I'm just gonna hit continue. Last night I oh, we got Austria. Swimming in an ocean of orange soda. Actually, oh, cool. It may have been a fantasy. Oh, well, we have definitely heard that one before. Now, how can Lauritsen play out of the middle? Since when is that a thing? Ever. I didn't even know he could do that. First time catching a stream in a while. Just got back from Australian vacation. Found nice. this little local cafe where, on Wednesday, they bring in the local medium-sized marsupial to serve everyone. It was a koala tea service. Okay, the Dorfers are back. Away to Hartburg, back. It's only been like five or six days. Regal, there we go, Marcel. Oh my. I haven't exactly started this game well against a team we know isn't that good, but Christian Kuba can change all that. Oh. 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 Why do we shoot first time? Why do we do it? Take a touch and then shoot. Okay. Middle. Middle. No, well, no. He didn't make the run. Never mind. Chill. Just vibe, really. Oop, shoot it! <sighs> Please. Yes! Ref! Look, I don't have my wallet. Um, I can offer you this stress banana. Um, and we do have a club condo in Zurich, in Switzerland. Uh, you are more than welcome to have that. Like two weeks out of the year. Three? Okay, it was three. Good. Ref! Come on. Pablo! <laughs> For Kim! Kim Hyun Hyu. Oh my goodness, Baron. Yes, yes, Marcel Baron. Are you aiming for the Austrian version of I? I'm always aiming for the wherever I am version of IX. What a turn. What a. This is what we needed. Shoden is, is actually going to die. He is going to die. There are 20 minutes left in this match. He's going to pass. You know who it is? Hector Hellman Zapata, baby. He's at least a solid defender with solid athleticism and like passing ability. He'll do it for 20 minutes and he'll be fine because we're up three to nothing. Like I was saying, he will be fine because we are up three to nothing. Zapata already got booked. Yeah, I really, we, we, we pick up a lot of bookings in this team in general. I think we just have like a lot of ag aggression and bending the rules and stuff. That is good work. Three second half goals. We had a few more chances that we didn't take. That was good work. Very pleasing uh, victory. Very pleasing second half, I think, for us. We're a point off Salzburg. We are three points off Rapid Vienna. And a point off Altus Reinsdorf, who have like another... Uh, <laughs> Altash Reinsdorf, who have another match in hand. This is a, uh, a, this is good though. This is good for our build the nation, even though it's going to make the league race a little bit more nerve wracking because it's not a two horse race this year. Okay, France at home. We win this match. We are actually in the Euros. If we don't, it's going to come down to the final day in us against Azerbaijan. But if we look at 
should be the second place team table. We are quite literally on top of it. And based on results of other teams, we could even clinch with a loss. But to be perfectly honest, we only lost three to two in Paris. And now we get to play in Vienna. And I want world rankings so that we end up in a better pot for like every draw ever. So we want this badly. We've already beaten Brazil. And after we beat Brazil, I'm now convinced we should beat every team in the world. Let's play our game. Yusuf Demir, Sevald, Sabitzer, Grealich. Lamer, Weber, Posh, Marisic. Do I want to go off and Gruber? I don't want to go off and Gruber. I don't want to go off and Gruber. I don't like off and Gruber. Land of the Hammers, Theodosterike. Come on, Austria, yeah! Come on! Euros qualifying, Austria and France. Any points at all qualify us automatically for the Euros. We won all three. Because we're playing for that sweet, sweet world ranking. There you go, Zabitzer, Erkan Kara, Hannes Wolf! Oh my goodness, Weber, shoot, shoot! It's like a goalkeeping drill back there. Jonathan Ikone. Really? Interest. Uh, that's way closer than I thought. Yes. Yes. My boy, Erkin Kara. <sighs> Come on. Get in. Woo! Zuber, I think. Easy, easy save. It's easy save. Oh my gosh. So, 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 so. Fun first half. Nice. Oh, uh, John. The Austrian striker. This is an excellent spot for Sabitzer, for Yusuf, for Arjun Kara! Oh, Yusuf is tired. Of course he is. What a melon. Oh boy, Dario Marizic. Uh-oh. Oh, Dario. Ooh, that was just lucky. Okay, that was just dumb luck. Dario Marizic was on ice skates for that. Nice. Limer. Baumgartner. Limer! Baumgartner, you! Yeah! And he's missed it, and the ball's gone all the way into the back of the net. Unbelievable. The simplest ball. Ah, I don't hate the way we've played this game. We just didn't take our chances. It's a very silly goal to give up here. Just a bad line from Limer. Am I playing an extremely high line that I don't know about? Like, are we? What are we doing? We weren't bad. We were just aloof for seven minutes. Ah. On to Azerbaijan. All right, so France has won the group. Albania has beaten North Macedonia. We already have the head-to-head -head against Albania, so they can't take second from us. But we do play Azerbaijan in Baku in three days. And we we will start Sabitzer, but it's Gruel and Kalajic, and I mean, technically this match doesn't matter. I just, you know, I would like to win in Baku, Azerbaijan. I feel like that's something that I should do as a national team. Why can't I rest players? Like, why can't I go to, why, why can't I go to Yusuf Demir and just be like, hey, you're kind of important to like what we do. I would really, really, really like for you to 
just not train for the next two days so that you can play for us. And it's like, no, nah, man, got to make sure we hit that training grindstone for the week of international duty. Nah, fam. Okay, here we go. Away to Azerbaijan. Basically the longest away day you can have outside of playing in Reykjavik, I think. I just never really was super into like older databases. I'm sure it's great. It's just, it, it, it's not my, it, it's not my thing, right? Because he's off by the way. Um, away. Oh my goodness. The wall isn't even tall. We on the other hand are very tall. So this, oh ref, I mean ref. Ref, ref, ref. Marcel. Easy. Goal! And last rose hurt. Okay, uh, let's go with Conrad Limer. Baumgartner. Gruel! Bulgaria is winning three to nothing, which already evens the goal difference. Sweden needs a point against Denmark or Bulgaria is going to replace Sweden at the Euros on the last day after their unreal, unreal draw against Italy. There's Kalajic. Great pass by Christoph Baumgartner here. Bink. Sasha Kalajic. But to go six for six against all those teams is just monstrous. Don't lose that foot race. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Garou! He could totally score this. Sabitzer still got a little magic left. Look at that. Nice. Nice. Cool. Should make my last sub. Yay! Dario! I'll get that sub in now. Um... Uh, you give David an opportunity. David Nemeth. Dario Marisic with a send-off goal. You're way too good to be doing that, Yusuf. Be honest with you. Oh, now Nabiev is just going to go off. Honestly, yes. Oh, no. Uh, what? Uh, Yusuf Lawal having the game of his life? Okay. Like, I'm really happy with the flow of the game. I'm just not not happy with our tidiness. But we did win. 4-2. to two. That's a road match. Long way away from home. And there we are. Headed to the Euros qualification. In the bag. Just a great... Okay, that final day of matches. Let's see if it works the way I thought it did. It does in Sweden is out Bulgaria takes the last spot and the only second place team not to qualify for the Euros is Sweden thank you uh Kazakhstan apparently Danny Ding got his 12th cap at 19 years old and now we've got another in They are just kneecapping the only players that I that I want to be around this team. That, that is all that is happening. It is a targeted effort. I think the mob is involved. They have one injury at a time, and it's always one of the four best players on my team. I swear. Let's see. Danny Ding probably shouldn't be there, but we'll keep him there because he's somebody that can definitely... And this is going to be a tough match. Uh, this is, uh, you know, against Rapid Vienna, who is... Literally starting Urgen Kara, who we start for the national team of Austria. They also have Vessel Dimiku, who is my player for the Austrian national team, and our former center back, Caleb Spear of the United States. 
Sestak. I really hate the idea of making Sestak the captain, but that's what we're going to do. David Sestak is wearing the captain's armband today because Pablo is unavailable. <sighs> Middle of the box isn't as effective because you can't create the kind of traffic and runs you can create near and far post. Yes, yes, we need this. No. Oh, it's not a foul. It's not a foul. All right, Mateus. You're like the goalkeeper of the year in this league already. Danelli. Oh, shoot. That's annoying. Nice by Jean Rogel. Chris and Cuba. Back to front quickly. This is good. Rusu. This is very good. This is Sestak, dude. Holy cheese whiz, Batman. That's, oh my goodness. He's off. Thank goodness. But Danelli literally could have just caught that ball. I don't know what he's doing there. Yes. Yeah. Oof. Make things, make, let's make it weird. Give me this. Man, that's frustrating. There you go. Let's just keep it going. He's offside. There we go. Raguel is still making plays. Yes, Rusu. Rusu! My God, dude, that was so far away from the goal. You don't deserve it, and we're a better team than you are. So get out of my face. They don't deserve it. We're a much better team than they are with a half-rotated team. Ridiculous. That is so annoying! Ah! Come on! How do we not score? We didn't even score once. Even a man down. We were the only team close to the goal. Okay. Everybody's fit. Good. Danelli, Rogel, Brodniak, Skanderovich, Igor Shudin, Vince Brody, Danny Ding, Owen Vanderhorst, David Sestak, Paul Rusu, Mate Balaz. We have a couple extra center backs on the bench because we realize the fact that we might want to go to a... Uh, <coughs> we might want to go to a back five, especially if we take an early lead. Uh, go to a back five. They're going to start Moise Keen, Kiesa, Kulisevsky... Uh, Vitinia and Sander Berg. Gods. We come to you today. To ask that the unjust nature of our defeat to Rapid Vienna be repaid against the Juventude today. Oh, in your infinite wisdom, give us the cheap penalties, the straight reds, the lovely volleys, and the short throw magic in our favor against Juventus today. For Juventude is no match for our faith in you, FM gods. Please accept these hands of prayer from those in the chat that believe in you as well. For all the kindness that you have bestowed upon Floridsdorfer AC, these 
past seven years. We pray for victory against the old lady. And so, in the name of Johnny Cano, Johan Kernan, Juan Scherrera, and Joe Lewis, we pray League, but for a Champions League spot itself, we're very much in it. We need a famous night. We need a famous night from the boys on the field today. We have faith in all of them. We've got a pretty darn good starting lineup out there. We're only missing Hector Elman Zapata from our whole preferred starting lineup. <sighs> we might change the playmaker role to an advanced playmaker on um, Owen Vanderhorst. The magic boots of VDH instead of Vince Brody if Brody starts out playing poorly, but we'll see if they leave him alone or not. Because Brody should be open. Playing against a, a 4 2 or a 4 3 3 like they've set up in, Brody should be open for time and space to like pick out passes. But we'll see. All right. Quick combination, early goal. Well, that is super not what we were looking for. Thank you, Danelli. Hey, everybody take a breath, okay? Everybody, we drew this team at home. You do it again or beat them. And now back into the middle. Brody is going to be open here. They're pressing really far forward with their midfielders. Brody, you've got to be able to put that pass together. Thank goodness he couldn't find that ball in time. And then uh, the longer the match goes on, the more it mentally turns in our favor. Holy smokes. He is scary, dude. Back and then, oh, up to the midfielder. Perfect. Bad touch, though. Why? I mean, I am baffled. Nice. That's what we want from Brody. That is just not the spot that pass is supposed to go into. Now, that is Rusu. Paul Rusu. Okay. Way to keep it chill. Defense, honestly, recovered super well. Yes. Yes. Owen! <laughs> Sestak off for Kim yun Q, who plays with a ton of confidence in big matches. And we are going to leave Regal in until the 70th. We are actually going to take out Mate Balaz and bring in Marcel Baran, which might seem crazy, but he's shown a ton of improvement. And... He's got a load of pace. He can completely take the lid off a game. He's offside. So good line again, defense. Way to contest. Again, they have 24 shots and just 2.1 XG. So we're keeping their chances on average low. We, can, we, we have to live with that, you know, with who we are. Oh, yes. Oh, they made a mistake. Oh, my goodness. It's Rusu. Cross it. Baron! They don't believe in miracles! They lead at Juventus! The upstarts from Austria! It's Marcel Baron! The substitute! Owen van der Horst makes the play! It's a scrumptious ball! Rusu to Baron! And they struck like lightning. Yep. 
He's off. On that one, I wasn't sure if he was offside or not. I was not sure if he was offside or not, but he is. We Our back line has done such a freaking good job of that offside trap today. Look at that. Great step. Great step. He was, I don't know why my brain didn't pick up the fact that he was offside immediately. Because he was that's like the most offside of all of them. Alrighty. Just keep getting in the way, guys. Just a little bit too far for him to tap it into the back of the net, huh? Okay. Ooh, Mama Kim! What a tackle by Kim Yoon Kyun! Wow! Dude! Never for a second did it look like he was going to put a foot wrong. That was a fabulous tackle from the Korean sensation. God, look at Igor Shodin. He's played like 8,000 minutes in the last two days. The only left back of the team, and he's the guy with the hustle to clean that up. Let's go! Let's go! Yes! Yes! They call him Mourinho. Got a little Mourinho in him. We gave up a ton of shots. We just didn't give up any clear chances. The one with Chiesa and the one with Moise Keen were the only one that I was like. We didn't give up any clear chances and we created the single highest XG chance in the match. The transcendent Floridsdorfer with an unbelievable win at Juventus. Win at home against Chelsea as well. A draw at home against Juventus. We have the head-to-head. -head. Yeah, Shell Lucas, are you watching? You watching, Shell Lucas? Because that's what's happening, yo. Yo. And we also just made three million. Dude. You weren't even... I hate that. He was... Like, he could have kept playing in the game. Pulled knee ligaments.